This is the Star Wars Hero Mashers Han Solo versus Boba Fett two pack. The, the set is part of the first wave of Star Wars Hero Mashers figures, and uh, they look great. They really do. And here is the packaging. Very cool. Here's the rest of the assortment. Just like any other regular mashers, they have removable limbs that you can interchange with any other of the hero mashers, be it, um, you know, Transformers, Marvel, or Star Wars. Better for Star Wars. So, here they are. Uh, Boba Fett. Let's start with Boba Fett. Since I've already done a review of the single packaged Boba Fett, this is exactly the same Boba Fett. It's got the same backpack. He's got the same body mold. It's got the same blaster. Uh, that that came with the single carded one. The only difference is, is on this side, he's got the uh, flamethrower, which does not have the the flame, and instead of the uh, the well, actually here instead of the flamethrower, he's got that um, I don't know if it's a missile or that grappling gun. I think this is the grappling gun that he shoots to latch onto your arm. And here you got the flamethrower. So that's the only difference. And the the original. The one in the single card one had an actual string grappling hook and, and a uh, molded in flame for the flamethrower. That's that's the only big difference for this figure. But it's exactly the same, same paint apps, exact same masher figure. So, there. Uh, Han Solo is actually new. I don't think there is a single carded Han Solo. I wish there was so that they'd give him a carbonite version, but uh, nothing. He comes with two blasters. He comes with the Stormtrooper blaster, the DC-19 uh, DC carbine. And then uh, he's got his trademark Han Solo pistol blaster that has all that blasting effect. And uh, quite significantly, he has the, uh, self con the uh, breathing apparatus that he uses with Chewie when they go outside the Falcon, when they land the Falcon inside that big giant worm or a big giant snake, space snake, whatever. And anyway, that's what they use. So pretty neat. Uh, you can you can remove it if you want to. Let me see. Yeah, that's the easier way to do it. And you can latch it on elsewhere instead of here. You can put it here or on his back or anything like that. Or he can you can make him hold it, which is how it was, I think, in the movie or something like that. Uh, I think it looks better this way. So, yeah. It's great. Um, and again, because these are 2015 releases, they only have swivel shoulders and no ankle joints. Paint apps for both figures are actually spectacular. It's just brilliantly painted figures. Very, very nice. That's what you would expect with a Star Wars figure. Um, I think the whole set is great. If, you don't, if you're looking to get both figures anyway, um, I think you can skip the single package Boba Fett and just get the two. You're going to get Boba and and Han. Very cool figures. The figures are going to get a 9 out of 10 for me. Um, articulation has really put them down, but overall they're very good. I think they're great. Um, they're a great set. If you're going to get a two-pack, this is probably the first one you want to get. So there you go, folks. Hope you've enjoyed this little video review. This has been the Star Wars Hero Mashers Han Solo vs. Boba Fett two-pack. Thanks for watching.